Today we're going to learn about the story of Daniel 3, the image of gold and the blazing furnace. Our story takes place in Babylon. Nebuchadnezzar is the king. He has set up a huge idol for his people to worship. He said, Nations of people of every language, this is what you are to do. As soon as you hear the sound of instruments and all kinds of music, you must fall down and worship the idol. Whoever does not fall down and worship will be thrown into the furnace. So, when the music started to play, all of his people fell on their knees and worshipped. But there were some Jews who paid no attention to Nebuchadnezzar's rules. They did not worship the idol. Nebuchadnezzar was very angry with them, and he summoned them to his palace. He told them the rules once again, saying if they did not worship his idol, they will be thrown into the furnace. But they replied, If we are thrown into the fire, the God we serve will be able to deliver us from it. We will not serve your images of gold that you have set up. Nebuchadnezzar was even angrier. He was so angry, in fact, that he did not wait for them to disobey. He ordered them to be put in the furnace immediately. But they did not fear. They kept faith in God to keep them safe. They were thrown into the furnace, but kept faith still. Then, to everyone's surprise, they were not burnt, and another figure came through the fire. An angel, one of God's beautiful angels, came out of the fire, protecting his brave followers. Nebuchadnezzar said, Praise be to the God of these people who have sent his angel and rescued his servants. They have trusted the king's commands and were willing to give up their lives than serve a God except their own. I now order that my people who say anything against God's followers will be wrong. So, because God has brave followers, more people learn the word of the Lord. And now has God you as well to trust in him.